Let's unleash the lawyers. Joining us tonight, Susan Moss out of New York. Daniel Horowitz, our battling defense attorney out of California. Jeffrey Steinberger joining us out of L.A. Out to Jeffrey Steinberger, defense attorney. You know, Jeffrey, it sounds like she wants her cake and wants to eat it, too. In that, they're going to, she, she, they've got her red-handed. Stalking this woman, she's on video. Uh, tonight, we're going to show you in a few moments uh, video surveillance of her immediately in lockup there at the airport, very distraught. She wants to claim a mental defect, but that yet she wants to claim she's a good mother and the children should be with her at the same time. What about it? Nancy, you know what? They don't have a red hand because none of this evidence is going to come in. Uh, you know, your guest talked about being properly Mirandized, and she wasn't properly Mirandized. She was sitting in a little 12 by hole. They did an Adam and Eve seduction number with her. They put her in a little 12 by 12, a little little closet of a place, gave her no food, no drink for 12 hours. Three sat hours. Sat her down there, wet up 12 hours. Three sat hours. Her down there, and. Didn't get, and, and the cop comes in and says, uh, you know what, let's just give, I'm going to give you an apple. Let's talk about the uh, our feelings. And are you going to use any of this against me? No, I promise. I won't use any of this against you. You know, so they just hustled her. Look, I like to be kissed when I'm being seduced. I don't like this stuff. There's nowhere so. in this transcript. Uh, back to you, Jeff Steinberger. You're doing a great job of twisting the facts. Hey, I like it. That's why there's prosecutors and defense attorneys. Nowhere in this statement did they tell her we will not use your words against you, Jeff. Where'd you get that? No, Nancy, there's part of there that he says he gives her the implication that, you know, my, no, sweetie, whatever you tell me, I'm not going to use anything he against you. He never said that. Where are he you says, getting that? He says in the transcript, it says on there that he says, you know what? Let's talk about your feelings. Let's talk about what you feel about this stuff. Okay, well, that's let's, not what you said. No, no. And then he says in that's there... That's not what you she, said. She directly says to him, you know what? Are you going to use anything about this against me? And he says, absolutely not. I mean, Is that just true, Jane Katsaris? Is that true, Jane? Does he tell her he's not going to use it against her? I didn't read that in the 72 pages. He should be punished, but not as severely as some of your guests seem to imply. He's not a total animal, Nancy, but he is a, a very, very, very sick man at this point. Jeff uh, Steinberger, Daniel once again thinks that a defen defendant is sick. The little girl is the one covered in second-degree burns, Jeff. That's right. And Nancy, this guy uh, is the poster child for diminished capacity because no one could be that stupid, that dumb, that irresponsible, that insensitive to put a two-year-old in a, a, in a uh, cycling machine. Uh, it's just not going to hold up a court, but he's an idiot and a moron, and he has, I don't think his defenses are going to fly here. Saturday's not going to work. State of mind's not going to work. The only thing is maybe he didn't get a flight of public